the spring program was a little different than the year-long program. When we got there, um, got right off the plane, went straight to my homestay. I stayed with my homestay with my host family for about a month. And then after that month was over, I had the opportunity to either stay with them again for the rest of the time or to find my own housing. And I chose to do that. I essentially used the Spanish version of Craigslist and found two guys and lived with them for the rest of the time. I thought it was great because I had both um, experiences, which was really nice. Uh, my program started at the end of August. I left one of the last days of August. Uh, we arrived at the airport, um, immediately went to the dorms where we stayed for two weeks. Um, they're individual dorms, you had your own bathroom and everything, and we were all in the same hallway. Uh, so we had meals provided to us by the cafeteria and everything like that. I had sheets provided to us, someone cleaned our room. Uh, and then it, within those two weeks, we had to go find our own housing in the city. I chose the year-long program instead of the semester program because I felt like after a semester I wouldn't be acclimated enough to the culture. Like after a semester, I would be just getting used to everything and then it'd be time to leave. And I just figured, why not go for the year? I chose to do the semester program because it worked better with my schedule. Um, I needed to take care of a lot of uh, major requirements here and um, I was hesitant to spend a whole, uh, whole year abroad in order to graduate on time. So I chose, I thought the semester program was the perfect length for me. I took mostly Spanish classes, Spanish language, literature, culture, things like that, and then um, a couple other like geography type classes to work on um, major requirements. And I think it was really good in solidifying the fact that I want to do something internationally. I know now that I want to do like international law. So um, I thought that being in another culture like that really helped me decide that, yeah, that's what I want to do. I learned a lot of things from Spain. Obviously one of my original goals was gaining fluency in the Spanish language. So from that I've kind of have the itch to travel to all different places and see the cultures that are there. Um, I'm not sure they'll take me back to Spain or somewhere else Spanish speaking or just somewhere else in the world. But I do want to go abroad again. Um, there was a favorite restaurant my friends and I all went to quite a few times, Casa Paco became um, conocidas there, known as like regulars. They would give you free drinks or they'd recognize you when you came in, so that was a really cool experience. So I did spend uh, quite a few nights there. Um, in terms of study spots, I would either study in the parks or I would study a lot in my, um, I would study a lot in my apartment because libraries just aren't the same there as they are here. Like they would just close and they'd be closed for part of the day. You couldn't get on computers, so I just found a lot more consistency in my apartment being able to study. I chose the Madrid program over the other Spanish programs simply because it integrated you the best into Spanish culture. Like I said, we do like the homestay option and I moved into an apartment with random Spaniards. But also at the same time, we were taking classes. It was a direct enroll program, so we were taking classes through the Spanish university with Spanish students. So I met a lot of Spaniards there. And I know that the, the other programs are great in that they, you learn a lot through them too, but you don't get to meet the people there as easily. I miss the Spanish way of life a lot. Um, taking time for people, just taking life one day at a time. There are definitely some struggles and frustrations to acclimating yourself to the Spanish lifestyle, but all in all, it's a culture that really values time with people, values their family, and they really make time for each other and just take one day at a time without the stress and everything of that.